hello welcome back today you guys are getting a bonus video because i have decided to react to the real housewives of potomac trailer um as we know the new season is coming up and bravo has just dropped the trailer so let's just get into it i haven't heard anything i don't know what's going on this is gonna be a a very natural reaction but wait before that i just wanted to ask you guys really quick do you guys want me to do reviews to this season of Potomac? Um, meaning that when the new episode comes on on Sunday, basically, I'll try to have the video up by Monday and it'll be a recap of the episode and my thoughts about it. Um, I did that with Basketball Wives. Um, someone asked me to do it for Real Housewives, but it's too late in the season for me to start doing that. Um, but if you guys want me to, I will do it for Potomac. So I'm going to... How I'm going to create a poll in my community post, um, and that link will be in the comments. So make sure you click that link, go to the community post, and vote on whether you guys want me to do reviews or not. And, you know, we'll see based on the results. But, yeah, if you guys want me to react to the episode, I mean, not react, review the episodes, then just let me know, you know, click that link. We know how to communicate. Oh, Lord. I was with a hockey player? You're laughing. You're turning red. <laughs> Our class I figured that would happen. Unmatched. <laughs> this season on the Real Housewives of Potomac. <laughs> Try to be cute. <laughs> Man, this top is horrible. Half of your new booty don't fit, honey. My coochie is sweating. Sharice made it. <laughs> What's wrong with Karen? Sharice. I did not care for Sharice at all when she was on the show. Mm. So I guess she'll be back. He was doing that to get away from you. I have that effect on people. You and Michael are getting a divorce. We are. I am elated in a place that excludes her crusty ass grabbing husband. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I think that Candace and Ashley are going to be in a much better space um, with her divorce and Michael. You could kind of see it, though, in the last reunion. Um, they they weren't going at it too bad. You know, they would started getting along towards the end. So I always knew they would be back friends. Um, not feeling Robin's red hair. She always changes her hair. She's always, you know, she's constantly changing her hair. I'll give her that. You know, that's good that she's always trying new stuff. But I just don't like it. <laughs> I'm sick. I'm not sick. You think I was doing it for attention? I didn't care. In our marriage, you said that I could have eye candy. Karen was sneaking out of town with someone that wasn't ready. Karen, she is. to talk about getting a prenup. Why are you mentioning it now? Are there clauses about infidelity? Are y'all gonna get married though? asking me if you're sleeping with Peter Thomas. No, I'm on the exit on that. Oh, wait! Peter? <laughs> Patricia? <laughs> uh uh. Now, I remember hearing something about Giselle and Peter, but I thought they shut down those rumors that they was dating. I thought they shut those down. Peter? Uh, Peter just trying to stay on Bravo at this point. Like, you jumping from housewife to housewife. Honestly, I think Giselle would probably be a better fit. You know, they're both messy. <laughs> well, Cynthia was messy, but Cynthia was low-key messy. You know, Giselle is out in the open with her messiness. So they can be messy together. <laughs> on my period. 2.40 in the morning. I get this DM from Chris. The w and not your wife you come home at one o'clock in the morning not every day many a married man have tried me and i felt like he was trying to see if i was with it he's a sneaky link you want to say that my husband made you feel uncomfortable 100 percent dead. To well me. didn't they always say i could have sworn on one of those episodes um where they were playing like a couple's game with the with the boards or whatever and they said that um it was some game they were playing and the ladies had to say like which wife in the room the husband they felt like had a crush on or something like that and candace said that chris likes giselle he loves taking care of giselle 
and all of that i can't remember i can't remember the exact question but it was something along the lines of that and she had basically admitted that chris got a little crush on Giselle. and to be honest candace is a brat she is a spoiled brat she talks too much she's always running off at the mouth don't want know when to stop she and she's proud of that she's proud of the fact that she just verbally takes it to the gutter and she she brags about it we can all see chris getting fed up with like it's like taking care of a two-year-old nobody is gonna keep doing that it, it gets annoying it gets exhausting it gets draining i'm not condoning chris cheating i'm not justifying it because if if he wants to cheat he should just leave but are we really shocked candace like you're a lot Sharice coming back and you got Patricia I'm really shocked <laughs> um I wonder what the final straw was with uh Michael and Ashley or was it just that <laughs> those years was up because <laughs> if we remember they had to be married for a certain amount of years before Ashley could get whatever alimony or whatever conditions they had in their prenup so I, but still, like, there had to be a reason. So I wonder what that reason was. But yeah, that trailer was really, really good. I'm actually really looking forward to that season. And this season looks pretty good. One thing that I like about Potomac is that um, they don't change characters too much. You know, you don't get too many new people versus Atlanta, where it's pretty much like a new friend every season. It may not be a new peach holder every season, but it's pretty much a, a new person, a new friend, somebody we meet in. And um, I think Potomac, for the most part, sticks to their main cast. And it gives us time to get to know the characters and you know, and grow with them and things like that. So I like that about Potomac. But let me know what you guys thought about that. And again, make sure you go to my community page and let me know if you guys want me to start doing reviews to the episodes of this upcoming season. Um, Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.